Today we're going to talk to you about the uh, Quick Products Quick Lug Compressor Terminal Repair Kit. Uh, this kit is available from HVACRSupplyNow.com and I'm going to go through the steps on how to install this product. Uh, and the product is used on compressor terminals that are damaged. Let's go through the steps on how to install this product. Let's go through what the uh, set includes. It'll give you three wires, one for a run, start, and common, with the connectors on there, or the spade terminals. It'll give you three wire nuts. It'll also give you three of the connectors that go onto the terminals. It also gives you these three set screws, and that's in lieu of these um, screws here that use on that you, you would use it with a Phillips just because it may be tight where you're putting the uh, these terminals in so the you can use these set screws in lieu of the regular screw all right here's the compressor that we're going to be working on and I just want to let you know uh, on the the instructions for the depth now I'm not going to be able to get my camera in there so what I did was I have a picture of how far they're supposed to go on and as you can see in the picture, uh, they do not go over the insulator. They'll go just in front of the insulator. And um, that's important because you need to make the proper connections. After you put this on, I also, again, it's gonna be a little bit tight. So in picture number two that uh, is showing, you gotta make sure that you put the spade connector correctly into the, um, to the adapter. Um, it needs to go in this manner into the, uh, into the adapter onto the compressor and not vice versa. And as you can see in the, the diagram, it'll give you a, a better view or understanding on how that's achieved. We're gonna install the uh, terminals onto the uh, onto the damaged terminals on the compressor. All right, put your, uh, your adapter on. Again, make sure that the, the spade connector is in the up position when it goes in and not in this down position. All right, and that will just slide right up in there and you will tighten that with your screwdriver. And you'll tighten that down a little bit with your screwdriver and again, if the application that you're working on is tight or in a, you know, the, the, the junction box is tight, then you may want to use the, the little set screws in lieu of the screws. All right. And then we're going to go on to terminal number two. And what's nice about these, they have these little cuts here or angles that you could set the terminals or these adapters onto the terminals where they won't interfere and they'll fit really nice in there. Again, spade connected down, that gets inserted and then tighten down the screw or the set screw. In this case, I'm just happen to be using the screw for demonstration purposes. And then you'll put your third adapter on. You'll put your third wire in. Again, spade connector in the, oops, in the correct position. Tighten the screw or set screw, depending again, on your application and make sure all your lugs are tightened. Again, you can use the screws or the set screws depending upon how tight the uh, junction box is. And uh, there you go. Put your, join your wires together, use your wire nuts. And there you go. That is a setup on how to use the Quick Products Quick Lug Compressor Terminal Repair Kit. And that is sold by HVACRSupplyNow.com. Thank you.